dusty windshield. <laughs> We're on the way to Maryland. Yes, we are. Eight hours and 11 minutes, which has only gone two minutes in the last 10 minutes. Definitely. And uh, as you can see right now, it's 11.13 at night, so she stays up late, so she's going to take the first shift, and I wake up early, so I'm going to take the second shift. Yep. We are unfortunately in Ohio. <laughs> yeah. Back in Laurel, Maryland, Fusion, and we decided that we are going to take uh, the Celica back home to Kentucky with us, so yeah. So we've been letting Aggie's mom use the Celica, but as you can see somebody hit it, and they broke the fog light, they bent both the fenders out, they gave us this nasty ass fucking dent and also we bought her a jeep yeah so driving the celica back to kentucky tomorrow um looks like all the tires need air flat in the back look at this i'm here okay yeah all right so we're gonna see how she drives OSHA. Also, my mother-in-law is very short. Well, I guess the headlight's out too, is what she was saying. So let's see how she runs. Damn. Hell yeah, that's that shit I like. I gotta move this goddamn seat. <laughs> I gotta move this damn seat back. I zoomed in. Damn. Not even zoomed in. Alright, I actually have not driven the Celica since December. Okay, looks like the speaker doesn't work. Fix that, take care of that. Alright, AC still work? Ooh, damn, the AC still works. Alright, shout out to Andy for getting sun visors. Uh, these knobs, hello. There they are. Just cuz. I'll let it warm up. Ah! 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 That light is out. Something sounds noisy in there. Ah. Eww. Ropes. Imagine this, you pull up to the Wawa, new and Laurel. You get yourself two sandwiches, you get yourself a quart of oil, and then, buckle in first, and then you roll the windows down, and then you open the sunroof, and then you get stuck in fucking traffic. God damn it. I wanna see what this G35 is about to do, so you can hear him. But we'll wait. So, of course, <laughs> of course, cannot shift. Oh, here we go. Oh God, sign. And TC, God damn, fucking Maryland, man. Dog, man. Okay, I would just like to apologize to everybody uh, right now. Um, yes, it was an automatic. You probably knew that. It did not sound automatic. Um, I don't know. He was probably driving it like it was a stick. I know everybody who had an automatic as their first car who wanted it stick. You know, you'd know where it shifts and you would let off the gas to make it seem like, you know. But no, no, that was an automatic. And I apologize wholeheartedly for my mistake. Um, 
Yeah, you can hear it shifting itself over there. Dog, go. Oh, the power steering. <laughs> Sick. Uh, quite frankly, because I don't give a fuck, um, I did post this plate, and I'm not taking it down, and I will say, if there's a police watching this, um, he did just run the fuck out of a red light. Um, yeah, he, he just didn't want to wait. He just went, and it just shifted itself. So, yeah. Now, of course, I turned off the camera, and there was a sick fucking Civic. I mean, it had, like, hood exit and everything. Uh, it had stickies for the front. But anyway, she was cruising. Cruising. Living life. Vibing. All right, so after a three-hour endeavor, because right now it's 5.18, and I'm two-hour endeavor, I guess. I don't even fucking know. Two to three hours of an endeavor, at least, to get the fucking tire patched. Got there. They were not doing anything. Dude said, oh, well, there's no hole. I said, dog, look. It's been flat twice. Just fucking patch it. So I had to wait until the other car was off the lift. Blah, blah, blah. I was waiting there for an hour. So now, got to replace the damn headlight. One of these turn signal bulbs. And then I have to go back inside and get the jack from the Jeep. So I can replace Mr. Wheel Stud right here. Let's double check while I'm here. I'll make sure all the other wheels are tightened. Any other lugs missing? Nope, just that one. We're good. Now look at it. Damn. God damn. Oh, I did show replacing the turn signal or headlight because it's simple shit that everybody should know how to do. But both bulbs work. Um, I guess I can show you. I've never seen the bulb fall out of a sealed halogen before, so that was interesting, but yeah, now I'm going to put that back together, and I get to this wheel stud, not looking forward to it, as you can see, sun's beating down, not really windy, I mean, in Cincinnati when it's this humid, at least it's windy, but fuck man, I'm sweating over here, shit. Alright, so, after the three hour endeavor, he didn't even fucking patch the tire. Listen. Yeah. Fuck that place. They're open tomorrow, but we wanted to leave at 7 a.m., and they open at 8. But again, if you listen... You can hear it physically leaking. And I am, with my finger, plugging up this tire that I paid him 50-something dollars to fix. Christ. Are you fucking kidding me? Fucking Christ. I also find it cool because you can like literally hear the tire leaking and that's all you can fucking hear in the background, but... There we go. Also for the shoes, um, Aggie's mom didn't want me uh, using my white bands to work on the car and change the oil, so she let me borrow these. And indeed, none of us know what it is, actually. So if you know, write it down in the comments, pal. I don't like what you're doing. <laughs> so Dyson's on his way. See if my one and a half pound dead blow hammer will knock these studs out. Christ. Psst. There we go. There we go. Anyways. 
Oh. Alright, I don't... I don't even know. I'm just fucking losing my mind. No. Alright, so... Alright, so now it would be easier to the rotor off. Alright. Alright, it's the rotor. There you go. And now... There we go. Hopefully, it's gonna work. Of course it isn't. So... Fuck, I need a bigger hammer. I don't have anything. And we'll, we'll see. Alright. I hope you can see me. Oh, my arms aren't in the way. Different position this time. There we go. There we go. Try for a better swing, maybe. Looks like it's gonna transfer straight through it. This might be my best option. But it isn't. This dead blow is useless in this instance. It's Aggie's brand new crowbar for work. Pry bar. Sorry. We bought a sledgehammer. Nissan Altima. There you go. Dude, that dude fucking whiff a reefer. I put it in park, goddammit. Oh, I gotta put it in neutral. I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to I gotta do this. Clip. I know. I gotta do that. You just broke the I didn't break the clip. You just broke it. Look. You just broke it. License being a fucking fart baby. Jesus Christ. Cry. The fuck? Baby, you get this thing in. Oh. Yeah? God, it's going bonkers right now. Baby, you get this in. Ah. Got one stud in. And Aggie's dropping the oil. Hold on. Filter. Filter is behind the driver's seat. I'll get it out. Whip me hands. Uh oh. Uh oh. My hands are not strong enough. Right oh, what the fuck? Baby. What? Um, this isn't good. What's not good? This. I forgot to take out the thing. <laughs> that. The cap. Okay, I what? took off the I took off the oil cap. No, you did not. I, I had to take a bit She's of a my piss. Mom's, uh, Amazon vest that's in there. Uh -huh. Use my mom's Amazon. Alright, good. sound to be nice. I were a hundred miles out. overheating a little bit but can't really blame her as we came all the way up here 
looks like we got a little bit more to go. Fusion's doing all right for now. I don't want to jinx anything, but she got hot. It's still pretty though. Took her to the tire shop this morning. Got a refund. Took it to a Hispanic uh, tire shop, which I know I trust, and they hooked it the fuck up. So, let's keep you updated. Hundred and fifty miles away. We're in Albany, Ohio. A little bit of overflow coming. It's Ohio. Oh, shit. Ohio. Would you look at that? Fusion made it. God damn. She's dusty as hell. Mustang ruining it for real. That big old booty. Um, I think I overfilled the coolant a little bit because um, when we stopped at the gas station and here it's kind of puking out the overflow, but that's fine. Also, that looks new. Oh, damn, that's bent upward. I think. I don't know. Um, she also rubbed through fender... Oh, broke it. Fender liner. Uh, I don't know what happened there. But, she's here. She made it. If you noticed, a particular Mustang has moved, which means they can now be together again. Let me set this up. 